Hi, I'm AFC Wimbledon centre back Toby Civic, and you're about to go behind the scenes with the youth team in the FA Youth Cup. Well, it's uh, 6.30 in the morning, we're getting ready to head off up to Preston North End. With us the Dons captain Paul callan and coach Mark Robinson. Mark, did everyone make it on time? Yeah, we're just waiting for the last couple now, just behind you Rob, trying to sneak in. But yeah, no, they're, they're all here on time, um, five minutes late, but yeah, it's 6.30, so no, we're all ready, we're ready to go off in a couple of minutes. Paul, what's the mood in the camp heading up there this time? Um, everyone's excited and looking forward to it, and the boys are focused, so we've just got to go out there and do our best. Mark, what's the plan for the first day? First day, well, we're going to go um, straight up to um, Blackburn. We've left early because we didn't want to hit the traffic, so we're training at 3, 3.30 up at Blackburn's training ground. So it was a difficult one to either leave really early and give ourselves plenty of time, or if we left at sort of 8, 9, it could end up being a rush. So we've gone for the early option, and um, we get up there and train. I'm quite happy that the boys might be a little bit tired come tonight because it'll be good then that they crash out and get a good night's sleep. But yeah, we get to the hotel after we've trained at Blackburn, so we'll have a good session training at Blackburn and get to the hotel, have dinner. I'm sure some of them probably want to watch the um, Chelsea Liverpool game. We'll have a little team meeting and then um, get to bed and, and start the plans in the morning. Assistant coach James Oliver Pierce. What do we do on these long trips to sort of get through <laughs> to where we've got to get to? We we play a bit of FIFA. I've just uh, come off the game because Reese Bowers has uh, shielded the ball for about half an hour and I haven't managed to get a goal. Um, yeah, we're passing a bit of time. I beat all the staff, which is a huge positive. Who have we got on here at the moment? <laughs> We've got Jack and Reese on at the moment. Reese is currently 1 0 up with Atletico Madrid. Jack's Liverpool and is losing. Uh, but Reese is very effective and efficient, I think, by Mustard. So is it a winner? Winner stays on competition? It is a winner stays on. We've got a bit of a queue going back now. Um, they're lining up to play. Nick fancies himself as a bit of a FIFA player, but we'll see how that works out in a minute. It'll, He's it'll, just gone two 0 up, actually. Reserves. It all helps with the team bonding, yeah. It does. It does indeed. Everyone gets in a good mood, except for me when I lose. I'm not. I'm not very good at losing. I must admit. Assistant coach has not spoken to him for the journey. <laughs> so after a long journey up here. We first stopped off at the hotel and now arrived at the Blackburn Rovers Senior Training Centre to a big training session for tomorrow night's FA Youth Cup tie at Preston North End. So you can see the squad getting off, preparing for a key session with the gaffer, Mark Robinson, and his assistant, James Oliver Pearce, all the coaching staff up here. With me now, ahead of the FA Youth Cup tie up at Preston on Wednesday evening, is AFC Wimbledon under 16's coach Michael Hamilton. We're getting ready for uh, the game tomorrow night. Take, take us through the session, what we're going to be doing for the next couple of hours here at Blackburn. Um, at the moment, the boys are just doing little Don's Keep Ball, something that we do for the academy. So, as you can see, it's a 4v2. Um, and the two players in the middle just continuously pressing, just working on the boys on the outside technical. Then we're going to go into a few set pieces, throw ons, corners, free kicks that the boys have worked on all week and just touch on that. Um, and then at the end, Robert's going to go on as much as he can a, a, a game, um, 11 v 11, just working on some of the tactical stuff that um, the boys want to be implemented tomorrow. You must be very proud of a lot of these lads, particularly Joe Bursick and Anthony Hartigan, who work with you at the 16s now got pro contracts, yeah? Yeah, yeah, that's no, a massive achievement, and hopefully it's a carrot for the other boys who, who haven't got that far um, so far. Um, there's no doubt there's more potential in the group and like I said hopefully it, it, it makes the others see that it's possible with hard work that they can also go and you know earn their contract. Well with me now at Blackburn Rovers training facility is AFC Wimbledon Academy's Rob Toovey. Preparations well and truly underway for tomorrow night's Youth Cup tie at Preston North End. How's it been going Rob? Yeah it's been going really well so the boys at the moment are just working on a bit of pressing shape uh, so out of possession just trying to get our shape ready for tomorrow. Uh, worked on a few things regarding Preston after watching on video. Um, so yeah, just getting prepared for that. Any thoughts on the run so far? It's been going really well, hasn't it? The boys are an absolute credit to the whole academy and the club itself. They've like they've really bought into what the club is and the ethos of the club and that never stay say die attitude. So we're really really proud of them um, and hopefully they can go and do the job tomorrow. Right, so we're now practicing four penalties here. 
you can see this is uh, Paul Callum by captain taking this one. Struck with confidence there. This is Tom Scott. Got the confident one. A few saves creeping in now. Good for the keepers as well, of course. <laughs> Jade Mandel there. Keep the group like that one. Good way to end the session. Initiation sing song time. AFC Women of the Academy. Is Ed with the goalkeeper? Baby girl, what's your name? Let me talk to you, let me buy you a drink. I'm T Payne. You know me. Oh, I'm Ooh, we got to buy you a drink. Ooh, oh, oh. oh. I'm beautiful. My life is brilliant. You're talking, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Well, to relax the atmosphere here at the uh, team hotel before we depart for the big FA Youth Cup tie at Preston, we've got uh, Academy coach Mark Robinson and sports science and medicine manager General Richards with us as well. Um, Mark, how's preparations been going as we count down the hours now? Yeah, really good, Rob. Really, really good. Um, 
tried to make the day not fill as long as possible. Um, yesterday was fine because we got here, um, we checked in and then we went training. Um, so we had a really, really good training session down at Blackburn's training ground, which was fantastic. Boys were a little bit overexcited at first, but that was fine. So they got their out of their system, but got their out of their system. Sorry, Jenna, you're also of course the under 18s physio as well. Um, what sort of shape are we in going to this game? Yeah, really good. We had a couple of boys who have been injured um, through the season, a couple of long-term ones, which we um, often happens with football. So um, they're going to miss out tonight, unfortunately. Um, but apart from that, I've hopefully given Mark a lot of selection problems this season. Um, we've had quite a good year when it comes to injuries. We've implemented quite a lot of things that help with injury prevention. Um, so the boys do prehab, and we try to educate them as much as possible about their lifestyle away from Wimbledon. So what they do to recover, the things they eat, the sleep they get. Um, and this year has really uh, paid off, I think. Um, one of the other things the boys do is their strength and conditioning program. So the boys go to bounce twice a week and they work on um, not only strength, but also speed, agility, movement patterns, um, which not only helps with their performance, as Mark will probably add, but also helps with the injury prevention because they're stronger, um, they're more agile, they move better. Um, and so, yeah, that helps with both. And we've had some really good. Um, yeah, just results from that this year. We've been using bounce for the last three seasons, um, so this group of boys have been doing it for, for two years now, and it's been great. Well, with me now, assistant coach James Oliver Pierce was just about to set off for Preston. What's the message Robbo's turning to the boys? Uh, we've got something left on the table. Uh, we've sort of said, do not be afraid to fail. Instead, play without fear and be excited with what you can achieve. We just want the boys to basically do what they've done. They've, um, they've played some excellent football along the, um, along the way. And we just want that to continue. If they go into the game with any fear, then it will only go against their performance level. So we're hoping that little subtle messages like this um, will hopefully sink things in and sort of show that we, they have our backing and we're all in this together. Well, arrived at the uh, white dressing room. That's the North End. The squad are just settling in. We're going to take a walk out onto the pitch. That's what the lads will do tonight. This uh, FA Youth Cup tie against Preston North End. This is the site. Walking out onto the pitch. It's a tremendous football stadium. See the squad just getting a feel of the pitch themselves. You can see the images of uh, Tom Finney and Bill Shankly. It's a fantastic uh, stadium to play football in. Normally, Jack Wingate would be in goal tonight. He was, of course, for the Chelsea game, but uh, it'll be Joe Bursick tonight. Jack, what's your situation? So, I've been suffering with a rec fem tear in my left quad, which is my dominant kicking leg. So, I've been out for just over four months now. Haven't really trained or played at all. Um, only come back to training in the last couple of weeks or so. So, I'm gutted. It's a bit too early, but I'm sure Joe and the boys will do a great job and get the result tonight. So, you know, we've got a game plan. We've worked on it in training. Um, we've done different things and we know what their strengths are and also how we can hurt them. You know, we've got great movement as a front three and I think if we execute it well, we can really uh, get the right result tonight. Joe Bursick, you think he'll have a, a good game tonight, hopefully? Yeah, definitely. You know, Joe's done well in the previous rounds. He's a, he's a good young goalkeeper, very promising. So, yeah, I don't see why I can't continue his good performances. <laughs>
Number 19, Julian Andrews, calls for AFC Wimbledon. Disappointing, but uh, the lads bounced back at the weekend. Tell us about that. Yeah, I was very glad as the lads bounced back on the weekend and showed a positive reaction to winning 2 0 against Dagono. It was a very good start, and the seasons are coming to an end, so good reaction from them. I believe you want to say a few words to the supporters that travelled up there. Yeah, I'd, let, I'd like to thank all the supporters for coming up to Preston and supporting us and watching throughout the whole Youth Cup. I was very pleased and wanted to do it for them. Unfortunately, it didn't work out, but. Thank you. 